Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to solve a multiple choice question, which is a combination of two chapters, that is areas related to circles and triangles. Shown below is a sector of a circle with center P. All lengths are measured in centimeter. What is the length of PE? And there are four options given. So let us come back to this given diagram. Now it is mentioned in the question that PRQ is a sector of a circle with center P. So PR represents the radius of the circle and the length of PR is 6 cm. So let me mark here. Now P is the center of the circle through which an arc is drawn as we can see here. So length of PQ also becomes 6 because it is acting as the radius. So let us mark PQ as 6. Now we have to actually find out what is the length of PE. So we are going to drop down a vertical line from 3 till it reaches point E. Similarly, let us drop down a straight vertical line from 4 till point Q. And let me label these two points as A and B. Now, if we look at this, PBQ and PAE forms right angled triangles. And let us see if these two triangles are similar to each other or not. So I'm going to break up these two triangles and draw here again. So these are the two triangles I have drawn here for easy reference. So this is triangle PAE which is drawn over here and this is triangle PBQ, the bigger triangle over here. Now angle A and angle B are 90 degrees since we drop down a vertical line from point A and B. So let me mark here 90 degree and 90 degree. Angle P is a common angle for both of them. So angle P is equal to angle P. So by AA similarity criterion, we can say that these two triangles are similar. Now you do not have to prove and show anything because this is a multiple choice question. I am explaining this only for your understanding. Now once we have proved that these two triangles are similar, let us write down the lengths of the respective sides. So here PA, the length of PA is 1 cm, 2 cm and 3 cm in total. So we can write here PA as 3 cm. Now PE is the length we need to find, so let us take it as X. Now if we look at triangle PBQ, the length of PB is 4 cm, that is starting at 0 and ending at 4. So let us take PB as 4 cm. Now PQ we had already got the length as 6 cm, so let us write it as 6. Now since these two are similar as we saw, their corresponding sides are going to be proportional. So let us take X over 6, that is PE over PQ is equal to PA that is 3 over PB which is 4. Now cross multiplying that is taking 6 on the other side of the equal to sign we get X or the length PE as 3 over 4 times 6. Now 4 and 6 go in the table of 2 so 2 2 times is 4 and 2 3 times is 6 so we get here 3 times 3 is 9 9 over 2. So when we divide 9 over 2, we get the value of PE or X as 4.5 cm. So this is the length of PE. So let us see if it is in the option. It is option D. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. If you know any other way of solving this example, do comment below. And if you are liking my videos, like, share and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.